This is a function or waveform generator used at Purdue South Bend. This device can be used to simulate input signals to a circuit in the form of sine waves, square waves, ramp functions, pulse signals, noise, and arbitrary waveforms. There are many uses of this device, but this video will cover basic setup. The output activates the output. This allows setup of a signal before applying it to the circuit. A signal is set up by entering the frequency or period desired. The keypad, dial, or arrows can be used to adjust the values. Here, the frequency is set with the keypad and function keys to 1 kHz. Next, the amplitude can be set or the high level. Amplitude will be used for sine waves and high levels for the top of a square or pulse wave. The keypad is used again to set the amplitude to a value of 1 V RMS. And then any DC offset can be added or a low level can be set for a square wave. The signal setup here will be about zero, so there will be no DC offset. Again, the output button is used to turn on the signal to the BNC connector. When that is active, it glows green and the output off turns off the display. For the safety of a circuit, however, always turn the power on first and then the signal, so make sure the output key is in the off position before connecting the cable. A BNC to BNC cable can be used for higher frequency lab work, but for simpler circuits, a BNC to mini grabber will be used. Remember, the red mini grabber is the signal, and the black is the common. And as always, power down equipment and clean up when you are done.